Gabriel Infant was a quiet, laid-back guy who played the saxophone and filled notebooks with song lyrics, did math equations faster than his mother could swipe to her phone's calculator, and was the baby brother to four older siblings, his mother said. He had struggled with dyslexia but hoped to one day finish his bachelor's degree. He took the cabling job in 2022 for extra income, planning to send his mother part of his first paycheck. Things had been tough for Velma financially since Gabriel's father had died a year and a half earlier, she said, and that April she was grieving the death of her mother. Her son promised to help. Before June ended, he was gone. His mother's lawsuit, filed last month in Bexar County, Tex. Accuses become constructors of negligence, saying the company failed to protect its employees from the heat hazard or to implement protocols to prevent heat-related illness. His mother is seeking one million in damages. The suit also alleges that a foreman at the job site dismissed infant's symptoms, suggesting he was on drugs, even after an emergency responder said he was exhibiting signs of heat stroke. Rather than calling an ambulance immediately, the foreman first suggested calling the police, the lawsuit alleges. The suit accuses BCOM of creating an extreme degree of risk for workers, including by not having a first aid procedure, not adjusting work schedules in response to the high temperature, and not providing a shaded rest area.